Cooking Fresh with Roxanne. Hey, this is kind of part two to the zucchini flower episode. The Mighty Zucchini. Able to be ground into shreds and placed in the Mighty Dehydrator. Dehydrated for at least 24 hours. And then I put it in a blender. And as I mentioned, do not allow yourself to just think you can leave it alone. you got to check that blender. Sometimes this guy's powder gets down below your blender blades and it could seize up. So, don't let that happen. No more blender, no more flour. Now for the recipe I chose, I chose a coconut biscuit recipe. Reason being, uh, according to everything I studied, coconut flour is the closest to zucchini flour. Coconut flour, you use half again as much coconut flour to uh, the half again as much. Okay, one cup of regular flour would be a half a cup of coconut flour. So there's your ratio. Okay, one cup of regular flour, half a cup of, of uh, coconut flour. So also half a cup of zucchini flour. How I did this wasn't quite a half a cup. It was 30 cups of zucchini flour and about two tablespoons of coconut flour. So that made a whole half a cup. Put it in here and then put the baking soda with it, a whole quarter teaspoon baking soda, a whole quarter teaspoon salt, mix it up, dry ingredients. Then made sure I have my melted plant-based butter. You can use ghee. You can use regular butter. I use plant-based butter because I try not to get too much animal fat. Uh, at least, I mean, lactose fat. It's a breast cancer thing. Long story short, once everything's mixed up, we put it in the oven on our lovely baking sheet. Bake it up, 20 minutes, pull it out of the oven, mm. and we have these. Let me show you this. This is cool. Let's open these up. One of the things I want you to know is that I did different from a lot of what I researched online. I skinned the green zucchini before I made the flower. It has a slight green tinge too, as you can see, but not as much as it would be. I really kind of wanted to play down the green and just allow the flower to be what it was, which is delicious. Now, the thing I noticed about these, my partner noticed the same. Daryl said the same thing. They're light. They're lighter than regular flour biscuits. Mmm. I mean, you know how they said regular flour biscuits are like hockey pucks? No pucks here. Mmm. And you can use regular butter. Excuse me. Or plant-based. Either way. Like I said, I try not to get too much uh, dairy fat. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you so much for watching Cooking Fresh with Roxanne. Now, stay tuned. We're going to have another zucchini demonstration. This time it's my personal recipe for fried zucchini fritters. Gluten-free. Mm, get ready. See you later. Oh, and remember, if you know what's in here, you know what's going in here. Cooking fresh with Roxanne.